Yes. So here the graph below shows the variation in the first ionization energy of some of the elements in period 3. Okay. First ionization energy in kilojoule per mole. Yes, that's right. On the graph, use crosses to show the approximate value of first ionization energy. Okay, use crosses. Okay, give me one scan. So here you can see. Okay, first crosses. Okay, let me. Okay, so we can. Okay, let me open my graphic tablet. Yeah, I'll explain that, but you understand clearly. Don't worry. It's so easy. Yes, I am opening. Yes, now you can see here. Yeah, yes, don't worry about that. I'll explain that. Okay, it is your graph. On the graph, use crosses. Okay, cross is here. Okay, firstly, I have to mention crosses over there. It is here. It is here and it is here. Okay, then. Uh, to show the approximate value of first ionization energy okay so first ionization energy i think that uh, you can see this one first ionization energy so here is sodium First ionization energy, it is sodium, it is magnesium. So clearly, but you can see that ionization energy of sodium Na, okay, Na is less than, okay, Na is less than Al or not. Beta, simply that I explained that to you that ionization energy would like to increase from left to right, okay. So that means the left will be less and a little bit right that will be more, okay? How left means? Wait, 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 wait. How, how less? Wait, I am telling you. I am, are, are, oh, can you tell me that what is this? What is written here? 800, 2468, 800. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. So it is your 800 that is for uh, yes, 800 for silicon, okay, and mg that is here. Fundamentally, we know that. Fundamentally, if I would like to say that, fundamentally. That, that sodium that will have less uh, ionization energy than aluminium or not? Yes, and magnesium, so sodium that will have least, okay. So for least in that condition, wait, 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 wait. Uh, if you would like, like this. A, a little bit that I am enlarging this one, okay. Uh, uh, okay, okay, white, white, white. I am taking. Suppose that if that will be this, so a little bit that you can for related to sodium that it can be like this. Maybe, wait, hold on. Not like this one. A little bit it will be in this way because parallel line you have to draw. Huh? This one is this, and then approximately. No, no, okay, you can understand that either that will be dotted line, okay. Yes, yes, that's what I am saying, okay. So, whatever that I am explaining here, firstly, I am drawing the line, okay. Means, whatever line, what white line that is for a wait a second, that will be dotted line. You are saying, I am saying, I am writing the dotted line drawing, okay. Approximately, it will be like this, okay not in this way why it is not coming in straight 
Yeah, wait a second. No, no, because I am. I, I want to make parallel line just like as this. So parallel line that means it will be approximately. Yeah, I think this will be okay. So here, so approx. Yeah, it, it is good enough. Yes. So here in this condition that you can mention that with respect to sodium, sodium is here. So you would like to move above, 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 and it will be approximately here. Okay. Understand? Okay. So now, with respect to in the same way that sodium is less than aluminium. So what they are asking, sodium is less than aluminium. So sodium is this. Then how much? Sodium aluminium is 600, and sodium that will be. Yes. So so better. So beta, if you would like to uh, do in this way, so I think you have to increase a little bit white. Okay, white I have to take again. So in that condition, white just enlarge a little bit. Okay, up to potassium. Okay, up to potassium. Or firstly silicon that is given. So up to potassium, if you do that, then a little bit it will be like this. Okay. Here will be one cross, okay. Here will be one cross. Will be here also, okay. And then, then sulfur. Then again, it will get down, okay. Yes, you can get down for sulfur, okay. Here, and then again. You can move a little bit upward, and again it will be. Then here will be one cross again. It will be again cross. It will be again here one cross. Okay, one cross, and then oh my God! Wait a second. Wait, wait. No, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. I, I, I also understand that. That's why I am erasing that one. Because uh, I am not seeing your mark scheme, but I can understand in which way that uh, we have to do. That means uh, means you have to move up to here, okay, and then it will be approximately like this, okay? Yeah, and then it will be you have to make over here cross, okay? Here is cross, and then you can because that you have to. You have to be in the same line, okay? That means where you are seeing this uh, means dark line, okay? And then <laughs> in that way, from here you can see that you can match them, okay? Like this, okay? So in yes, means you have to you have to draw in the same way with respect to all the elements, you know? and now and now you can see that they are saying that approximate values of first hydrogen aluminum of sodium potassium and sulfur okay so sodium that will be approximately 525 525 okay <coughs> and uh, it will be 700 no sorry 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 no 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 It will be 700. Okay, okay. I am writing everyone. Okay, and it will be 600. Okay, and silicon that will be uh, 800 exactly. Okay, and it will be phosphorus again. That will be <coughs> 1000, and it will be 850. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Nine hundred, nine hundred, nine hundred, nine hundred, twelve hundred. At the last, it will be fifteen hundred. Okay. Silicon to potassium. <coughs> बेटा 
with respect to period okay first means period that means here you are seeing that there are three periods wait <coughs> it is first second and it is third three energy levels are there so when electron would like to move or accelerate fastly okay then <coughs> sorry it will decelerate okay after increment it will decelerate okay and then again for second period it will again accelerate and its energy level then it will decelerate and then again it will accelerate okay yes <laughs> because they are not saying that they are only asking the first ionization energy okay so three periods you are seeing here regarding to that they are giving so your diagram will be this one i think that uh, you send me mark schema give me one second Yes, 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 because in period from left to right, oh, oh yes, you can see that. Just see here the same way that you are seeing that in <coughs> sodium is here approximately 500, that is okay, and then it is 600, it is 650, okay, and then again it is 600, okay, it is with respect to first period, first period it is increasing then it is getting down okay then it is your second period because that if you would like to move down the group okay yes so that's why that energy would like to increase okay sorry energy would like to decrease sorry 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 energy would like to decrease okay but left to right it would like to increase okay yeah it would like to increase yes Are you, yes, in yes. Yes, exactly. That's the thing. Yes. <coughs> yes, because here that you can see that your this dark line, only your dark line was this one, huh? Dark line was your this one. Only this one was there. Okay. And at the last this one was there. Okay. So you have to firstly complete your diagram. So your diagram will complete in this way that with respect to sodium and aluminium okay so did sodium have less ionization energy so that means you have to get down okay with respect to aluminium okay and now up to here your graph is complete now just see that here is silicon okay and here is phosphorus so phosphorus have greater energy than silicon so that means it will go upward over here okay yes and then Phosphorus is there and now sulfur is there. So sulfur that has less ionization energy than phosphorus. That's why your graph is getting down. Okay. And then sulfur. Yes. So it will decrease for the third period. Okay. Because that if you are coming, it is your first period. It is your second period. It is your third period. Okay. If you are getting down.
Yes. Yes, yes. <coughs> Yes, that's right. Because that, if you would like to see with respect to orbital theory, so regarding to that, if any electron that would like uh, that will have the excess amount of energy, then it would like to move firstly the upper, and then it would like to less its energy. Then it would like to move upper, and then it would like to less, and then it would like so upper, and then it likes back. Okay. So you can see that the same thing that you are seeing that is also drawn over here in your uh, graph. Okay, understand? It is also known as energy fluctuation. Yes, understand? Okay, so now yes. So we can move to the WhatsApp and now I am refreshing. Do you understand? Yeah, it's coming again. I'll give me one second. So, yeah. yes, so the next picture is over, yeah, this one, so here, in this picture, E, F G okay so here they are asking that explain why the first ionization energy generally increases across the period okay <coughs> uh, first ionization in ionization energy increases across the period so in that condition first point will be nuclear charge will increase okay Okay, wait, I am writing here. Give me one second. First answer is that uh, first one that is your nuclear charge, nuclear charge increases. Okay, and nuclear charge will increase. So, in that condition. Secondly, force of attraction, attraction increases, yeah, greater force of attraction, okay, and the third one, that is atomic size, okay, because when atomic size, that will be less, then maximum amount of energy required to emit the electron okay okay next they are saying that yeah yes yeah you can check that it may be that uh, your teacher also explained that other reasons also are there so here that three marks question is there so that's why that i wrote three marks three question three reason Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Oh no, but I are atomic radius and atomic size that's the same thing. Okay. Atomic are you to beta I explained in your yesterday class that atomic size when the force of attraction increases, then the atomic size will squeeze or not. I am telling you that is the same thing. The three fundamental, yeah, atomic size decreases, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, if you would like to see your video, then just a few minutes before that, I explained that, that when this will happen, 
then the atomic size that will decrease okay <laughs> yes, yes, yes. I think that at the last, yeah, at the last that you can take that. Okay. Yeah, no problem, no problem, Peter, no problem. Wait. That is uh, given. Okay, it is going to explain why the first ionization energy of aluminium first ionization energy of aluminium that is yeah first ionization in energy of aluminium is less than that of magnesium okay so beta <coughs> you can understand that as we move from left to right okay magnesium is in third period second element okay Ma magnesium is in third period second element and aluminium that is third period third element okay that yeah wait wait wait, wait. i am i am showing you over here okay so that means in third period there will be like uh, sodium then magnesium and then there will be transition elements and then here it will be like your I think that what I am remembering that here will be aluminium okay so clear yeah yeah oh okay okay so here you can see clearly that magnesium is before than aluminium okay its size its size will be greater okay its size will be less okay so that means here force of attraction okay force of attraction that will be less here will be force of attraction greater okay understand so that means here force of attraction will be less so that means ionization energy that will be less okay less and force of attraction greater ionization energy greater that's it answer 100 percent yeah that's the reason <laughs> may be possible that they would like to give that the number of electron in the wait 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 um, Arjit Arjit one 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 answer you can also give one answer you, you can also give regarding to magnesium okay magnesium oh I understand that in which way that uh, answer is given in your book just see here magnesium having two electron okay plus two okay two electron in the outermost cell and aluminium okay having three electron in the outermost cell okay so that means it requires oh give me one second oh no, no it doesn't matter of that one i'm not seeing that one but in which way that you was a little bit that you are saying so then i understand that in which way Uh, give me one second. So here, beta, basically that what? Aram uh, Give me one second. Chali jao, kitanjali tak chali jana. Kardiya jod jana. Asanayat man suit jana 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 jana. Hey, no no. Yeah, I'm here. I'm here. So, beta, what I was telling you, I was telling you one thing that here that magnesium having two electron in its outermost cell, okay, aluminium that having three electron in its outermost cell, okay. So, yeah, basically one important thing that two electron requires less energy, okay, to remove less energy 
to remove okay and three electrons having more energy energy to remove okay that's why that aluminium have a higher energy than magnesium okay you can also understand in this way suppose that without your permission there are two people who would like to who would like to come in your house okay so and then in other condition in other condition on next day there will be three person okay who would like to come without your permission in your place so in which condition that you would like to apply more energy that's it what are yaar i am asking that suppose that in your place without your permission that there are two people okay and you have and you have to get out of them okay and on other condition that there are three people without your uh, inform uh, without your information unknown people three people that would like to come in your place okay and you have to get out of them so in which condition that you would like to uh, uh, you would like to apply more energy that's it and that's your answer <laughs> Aluminium has more electron in the outermost cell than magnesium that's why it requires more energy to remove electrons okay with respect to magnesium that's your answer that's why that ionization energy that of aluminium is greater than that of magnesium okay are yaar sim and, and you can also understand wait 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 wait, wait. Yes, yes. Why? Because that three electrons. When when an atom will occupy by three electrons, okay, that's a shielding effect. That will be more than the atom shielding with two electron. Okay, you can simply break that. Okay, you can simply break that. And by, means it is also just like as condition. Suppose that in between you are and there are two persons surrounding you to protect. Okay. and on the other condition that there are three persons who are surrounding you to protect in which condition that you will feel more protection that's it simple <laughs> so that means shielding effect that will be more than in aluminium okay then magnesium <laughs> I I can I say in simple sentence can I say in simple sentence in simple sentence how many number of electrons will be in outermost cell okay they requires more energy to emit okay more energy to emit and also they will apply more shielding effect okay yeah they will apply more protection with respect to atom that's it means if you will understand that yeah it, it, it if you will understand the base then it will not be possible uh, in it, it is not possible for you to get lower mark yes 100% you get efficiency hold on i'm opening that <coughs> give me one second wait outermost oh wait outermost electron in 3 minus p subcell oh yes that's right because aluminum 3 subcell orbital or higher of higher energy level but the same thing that they are giving here okay in beta you you know that uh, actually acceptable answer that means that they are writing in a very straight way okay but you have to explain that okay not in a straight way yes yes three yeah three electron in the outermost cell and two electrons will be in the 
outermost cell of magnesium that's why that aluminium requires more energy to emit electron okay that's it one mark that will be given to you in secondly as much as the number of electron if the nuclear charge will be greater okay then shielding effect will also be greater that means in that condition also the maximum amount of energy required to remove them okay yes okay uh, wait hold on i have to yes if maximum number of electrons electrons will be in outer cell okay outer shell okay then then due to due to decrease in size okay decrease in size requires requires maximum energy okay yes that's your next answer means clearly if you want to write that so first one is with respect to nuclear charge okay nuclear charge okay that's why that because nuclear charge first condition is that your nuclear charge second is your shielding effect okay shielding effect okay yes if you write these two point then you will get perfect marks yes because that they are also they are also they are also explaining same thing shielded by you are you can see that slightly shielded by three electron okay slightly shielded by two electron so i think that shielding that will be applicable when there will be maximum electron okay yeah <laughs> okay beta actually actually in this type of in this type of in this type of question you just have to learn that what means just learn that from left to right that ionization energy increases okay there are three factors by which ionization energy increases what first one nuclear charge secondly first one is nuclear charge okay secondly that force of attraction and third one atomic size okay only three so in any of the question in any of the reason if you write three of them okay if that if that question is of three marks so just write down three all of them okay if there if there is two marks question just write only two of them simple yes yes oh okay okay yeah i was also thinking about that <laughs> that's it but uh, down the down the group atomic radius increases 
Yeah, because the yeah, simple fact is that when force of attraction that will be less, so that means the electrons in the outermost shell they have the tendency to lose their shell. Okay, that's why that yeah to lose their shell that means minimum amount of energy that is required to release. Okay, and that's it. Okay. Yeah. Yes, here it is. Yeah, yes, 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 here. Oh, sorry, I can't uh, minimize this one. Yeah. Yes, yes, but you know that uh, when I would like to write on the screen, so a screen that means uh, uh, then I can scroll that because it is not paint. So that's why that uh, I can't do that. But I hope you understand that actually my teacher when I was also studying in same grade as you are in, so my teacher also explained me only the single thing. He told me that yeah, why you are worried about all these? Simply three things that you have to understand. Okay. Are yaar, then you have to, beta, why you are arguing? Actually, you know that these are the fundamental reasons. Okay. No mark scheme, no anyone that would like. Are yaar, beta, in University of California, I generally used to teach some of the students. So, okay. Means not in professional way. Professionally that I am teaching there only physics and maths. Okay. But regarding to there, there are many students whom I am teaching, whom I am giving tuition. Okay. Their chemistry teacher, sometimes their chemistry teacher also would like to explain in a very, very typical way. Okay. When I used to explain them in a very convenient way, then they, when they generally used to go in their class and when they explain that question in the class, then their teacher would like to ask that, where do you get this answer? That's it. Because yeah, what your book that is here. Okay. I am also, I had also do is also studied the books of many professors. Okay. And professor is not a common person, beta. So, beta, the, uh, only only one thing, beta, only one thing you have to do that if your paper goes to London. So, London, there are professors, okay. I am also professor. I can understand that if your answer, these fundamental things will be there. Nuclear charge, force of attraction and atomic size. 100% I will give you marks, no doubt. That doesn't, and you know, and you know that doesn't matter of mark scheme, yar. Mark scheme is generally, uh, mark scheme is generally made up by your teacher, okay, in your school. Okay, no, no, no problem. So mark scheme that is from England. So you can see that what your mark scheme that you are showing me, that's meaning was the same, okay, what I am explaining you. Yes, that's it. Okay. <coughs> G. Okay. So G plays the following species in order of increasing first ionization energy. Okay. No problem. So it's a very easy. You can see that. <coughs> Simply, you can understand that here is S minus. S minus that means it is receiving electron. Okay. Receiving electron. Okay. It is your S, okay? It is neutral and it is giving electron, okay? So simply regarding to number system, you can do that. Neutral that will be zero, that will be S, okay? Receiving electron that will be S minus and uh, means, uh, uh, releasing electron that will be S, S plus. That's it, answer. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Yes. And it is the stable. Okay. You can check the mark scheme that uh, I am right or not. Yes. Always remember beta which, which atom that will receive electron. Okay. That energy will be least. Okay. And as usual neutral atom that is medium. And which atom and when atom would like to release electron 
then that's energy that will be maximum. Okay. Uh, yeah, and also, but you can understand in this way. Suppose that yes. uh, I can tell you. Wait, 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 wait. Let me think about the reason. Okay, 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 okay. Suppose that you are in your family. Okay, periodic table is also a type of family. Okay, so in periodic table, as usual, that we can understand. Wait, that if you are. Somewhere in your family, okay. So yes, it is not possible for you to. Uh, it is not possible for you to eliminate any family member from your family, okay. Yes. That means maximum energy that you will require there, okay. Yes. That's And right. it is very easy. It is very easy for you, okay. To get a member, okay. Uh, yes to your family okay okay yes so that means it will be s minus okay minimum and who is also already there in your family so that is stable okay ah oh, okay 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 understand yes 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 this one i understand this one i understand so the oh, next wait, one wait 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 arjit arjit wait a second <laughs> in another way also you can understand suppose that you have money okay with respect to money you can understand you okay. have 10 dollar okay Okay. Okay. It is. It is very. It is very easy to receive money from anybody. Okay. Okay. If anyone, if I want to give you five dollar, then it's very easy that you will say that, oh sir, I am very happy. Just give me. <laughs> okay. Yes. But it is very easy to give money by you. Okay. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, if anyone would like to ask you, okay, if anyone would like to ask you for money, any of your friend, so very least chances will be, okay, in a very typical way that you would like to give him money or not. Yes, that's right. That means maximum energy of your brain that you will use that either you have to give or not. Okay. Yes. Suppose that yes. any person is giving you money. So you will not use your mind, okay? Just give me. <laughs> that's it. Yes, yes. Okay. That's right. So that means you can see that when you are when you are receiving money, then less energy, okay? Okay. Suppose that ten dollar that you have, that is S, and if you want to give some money to anybody, then that is very typical. So maximum amount of energy that will be S plus, least that will be S minus, and you are S, okay? Yes, that's right. That's right. Understand? Yeah, this one I understood. This one I understood. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So what they are writing yes. here? First ionization energy. Yeah, this okay. one is fine. Oh, I think okay, okay. I think that's the same thing. That is. here will be S minus. Here will be S, and here will be S plus. Yes, yes. Actually, there's one file I'd like to send you, which is very important. You just you reminded me of that, which I'd like to discuss with you. One second, I'm just sending that file over to you in Skype. Oh, okay. Just send one me that. I'm here. This is a very important question, and I just remembered. You just made me remember that question because that was one doubt I was having. I remember. And also, I sent it after to you your Skype class, uh, your test is tomorrow. Yes, that's right. Okay. So very quickly, that I will upload that. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Okay. Yes, so can you go me? down, scroll down <laughs> to question number nineteen. Nineteen <clears throat> or ninety? Uh, nineteen. One nine. One nine. Oh, nineteen. Okay. Hold 19, on. Nineteen. Yes. Nineteen. Okay. Yes, this one. Nineteen A one. How do you do nineteen A I don't know how these arrows work. I know the rest, but I don't know the arrows. Okay. Actually, how these arrows work? You are asking, huh? Yes, I don't know how to do this question. Great, result. great, 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 great. It's your paint screen. You send me this one. Oh wait, hold on. Oh my God. You send me PDF. Yes. Hold on, hold on. Give me one second. You can just take a screenshot and yes, open yes, it. Yes, 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 yes. I'm opening that one. Give me one second. I'm taking a screenshot, but why it is not working? Hmm? 
Um, oh my God! Wait a second. Beta, uh, can I tell you on a paint over here? Yeah, sure. Yes, I will see the question over there and then I can explain you over here in a short way, okay? Yes. Yeah, a little bit also. Give me one second. I have to. What I am doing that it is not coming here. Give me one second. Okay. Okay, okay. I am I am explaining on the uh, left hand side of paint. Give me one second here. Yeah. Okay. Are you able to see clearly? Paint the screen. Yes, I can see clearly. Yeah. So here, beta, you can see that. Here you can see that. Uh, It's the right way over here. A little bit adjustment is also required. Yes. So yes, but they are saying that the first ionization energy of the elements of the period three of the periodic tables are okay. Elements are given. This this. Okay. Complete the electronic configuration of phosphorus. Okay. Can you tell me? Wait wait wait. Let me remember. Or uh, suppose that if there is periodic table in front of you. Uh, can you tell me that uh, what is uh, atomic number of phosphorus? I think 15. Yeah, 15. That's right. Phosphorus is 15. Hello. Yes, phosphorus. Hello. Yes, phosphorus is 15. 15. Oh, great. Yes. So, phosphorus atomic number 15, electronic configuration 2, 8, and 5. Okay. Yes. yes. Electronic configuration will be what? 1s2, 2s2, 2p6, 3s2, 3p3, okay? 3p3, okay. Yeah. And 3p3, if you want to, <coughs> I think not more than this one that your teacher can uh, do that. Means here after then you can see that there are three electrons then it will be px1 px2 px1 py1 pz1 <laughs> you can see yes. that so that means now here you can see that where you have to do in the with respect to first s orbit okay that's yes. why your teacher is giving this one okay yes, yes. you know this and for third shell and it is here, okay. Clearly, you can understand beta by changing color that I can explain you how it is working. <coughs> yes. First cell, two electrons of ordered pair. That means it will be like this, okay. Yes. In second cell, in second cell subshell, there are also two electrons. It will be like this, okay. Yeah. There are three electrons. Hold on, give one second. Now again it will be yes. So here 2p6 is there, okay, six electrons. So that means it will fulfill completely, okay? Yes, yes. Okay, and now 3s2. Third shell will also be complete. Now here 3p3. So now here you can see that there will be only one electron, okay? Yes. Like this. It is your whatever that your uh, teacher is asking there okay yes that's right oh so that means two two up down up down up down and then up 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 oh, oh i'm just a little confused uh, i forgot why is the three up 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 beta you can see that they are not in pair you can see they yes. are not in pair when they will be six then you can see that they will be pair okay 
Oh, so for every two there's a pair, right? What? For every two there's a pair, right? So in yeah. this case it's one suppose, S2, so suppose up down. Suppose that you can understand in this, so suppose that if there will be P4, okay? P4, okay. Suppose that if there will be P4, so that means now in which way that I have to do that? Just see that here in this box, okay? So okay. in that condition, I will do in this way, like a P4. So one will be complete pair, okay? And two will be like this, okay? So why not both of them are complete? Because that, beta in P there are three subsections, okay? Okay. Why? Because that it becomes P X, P Y, and P Z, okay? That's why we generally okay. use to draw three blocks, okay? Yes, that's right. So according right. to our bow, according to according to our bow principle. Firstly, it will fulfill this one, then it will be fulfilled yes. this one, and then it will be fulfilled this one. So if there will oh, be, if oh. there will be, <coughs> yes, if there will be three electrons, so you can see that you can ask me a question that sir, here will be two, here will be one, but no, you can see that due to equilibrium condition, okay, there will be okay. lone pair will be one, 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 okay. One one one. Then it will be okay. a little bit stable, okay? Because each and every element in the periodic table that I have the property of getting a stable electronic configuration, okay? Oh, so can you just repeat this idea to me one more time? I'm still not very confident about it. Can you just repeat this concept one more time? Beta, this arrow one. Actually, you just have to do that. First of all, that three S two up to three S two. You understand that? Uh, I'm, I'm not sure about it. Can you just repeat this one to me? Yes, why not? Yes, because this part is a little tricky. No, no yes. problem. No problem. Forget that. Okay. I am erasing all that. Okay. Give me one second. Okay. Yes. That, that's easy. I'll give me one second. Delete. Yes. That's it. Now, what do you have to do that? Pause for us. <coughs> Sorry. Okay, so phosphorus you have to write atomic number, atomic number of phosphorus that is 15, okay. So first 15, of all okay. that what you have to do, you have to write its electronic configuration 2, 8 and in last cell there will be 5, clear? Clear, this is clear. Now you have to write electronic configuration, okay. Okay. So electronic electronic configuration that will be for first one cell S, one S two one S two uh, two S two uh, S two and two P six uh, sorry two here P6. clearly you can see that in a P orbital there will be six electron maximum okay yes that's right and now it's complete because in uh, second shell there will be only S and P. In third cell, yes. there will be S, P, D, okay? S, P, D, okay. <laughs> yes. But here, there are only five electrons. So, you have to do that. Three, S, two. And now, two electrons now here. And then, three, three P, three. three. Do you understand up to here? Yeah, okay. clear. This is clear. Great. Now, for S, for S, there will be one block, okay? Okay. okay. For S, there will be again one block. Okay. For P, there will be a little bit larger block. Okay. Okay, which contains three part. You can ask three me that, part. sir, why there will be three part? Because in P, there will be sub shell in P. Okay, micro cell yes. that will be PX, PY, and PZ. Okay. Ah, okay, okay. 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 And now yes. come to the third one again. Therefore, S there will be one cell, and again there will be P for there will be three shells. Okay. Yes, that's, that's right. Yeah, and then you have to separate that. Clear? Now yes. come to your next. Here you are seeing that. Okay, with respect to red one. For okay. S, paired electrons are there completely filled. Okay. Okay. Because the keyword is here, <laughs> okay. Okay. The keyword is there. For S, there will be. For S, there will be complete shell. Again, there is S complete shell. Okay. 
Oh, so these arrows, opposite arrows, stand for a complete shell. Yeah, they are complete shell. Just see here. Okay. This one is for this one. This one is yes. for this one. Now this okay. one is for here. I am going to uh, draw there. So here, six electrons are there. So 100% that will be three pair. So you can do that one pair, two pair, and then three pair. Clear? Yes. yes. That means for every two, it's it's considered one. Uh, for one one pair is considered one with two unequal arrows. Yeah. So since there are three six, you divide it by two. Therefore, there will be three unequal arrows. And, and you know that. Yes. Arrows. And you know that. Now that in the last one, you are seeing that in p orbital there are three. Okay. So firstly, okay. you will do that one one one. Okay. Then if excess oh. of electron will be, then you will again repeat your process. Yeah. Oh, and how do you repeat it? Would you add another arrow? If, okay, arrow? okay, dear, I understand that. Just wait a second. Plus one, okay? If there will be plus one, that is four. So here okay. will be this, okay? Ah, if there will be five, it. plus one. So that means again it will be here, okay? Oh my god, so I can use this logic for the 2p6 as well, can't I? I can, it's better to write one, one up, three up arrows, and then there, since there are three more, then I write yeah, three more down arrows. Yeah, simply, how we explain that, it is not possible to, if there are, it is not possible to fulfill all the cells at random, okay? Well, what does that mean? Yeah, it means that, suppose that on the table there are three cups, okay? Okay, okay. Okay? And in yes. and you have to. There are three members over there. Okay, you yes. have hundred ml of tea. Okay, yes. You have hundred ml of tea. So first you will do what? Firstly, you would like to plug in three hundred. Uh, sorry, thirty thirty ml tea in e, thirty thirty ml tea in each cup or not? Yes, that's right. And then there will be remaining hundred cup. Oh, sorry, hundred ml. Okay. Uh, okay. Oh, sorry, ten ml. So 10 ml, 10 again, ml. you will start from the first cup and then you will uh, place there 3 ml, 3 ml, 3 ml, okay? Yes. And then you have all the cup that will contain the same amount, okay? Oh, I see, I see, I see. So, so one, I understand this very clearly now. I just have one thing to ask you. That means when I draw the first pair for two, two, it's easy. But when I get the number like six, it's better if I draw first all the up arrows and then. Yes, and this then case, and then three. yes. When you will draw first, first up arrows. So suppose that there is five over here, okay? So when you okay. will draw up arrows, then there will be remaining two or not? Yes, and then, then two, for you those have to draw two, down. 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 That's it. Ah, okay, 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 yeah. Yeah, that's pretty easy to understand. That's pretty okay. easy. Okay. Ah, okay. Yes, this one's pretty easy. Yes, one's Beta, pretty oh, sorry. You can take a screenshot of this one, Beta, because in your video, I don't think that this paint screen you will be able to see. Oh, okay, okay. okay. Yes, second, because okay. it's a PDF like of. So I think that this paint screen, it may be that that will come, or otherwise, you will see only the motion of my cursor there, you know. Oh, okay. Yeah, I took the pair. I took yeah, a you can take a screenshot I'll... of that one. Yes. And now, yes, but yeah. that's why I explained this one. A. That's, that's, all I'm, that's all I need, really. I think the rest I have to do by myself. So, I but have. if any, yes, and also class time is also over. So, we can just have to do one thing. But do you think that I have to upload your this class on uh, channel? Yes. Yeah, please upload this class. Cause it's yeah, 100%. Serve. I'm going to upload that just after you. And within, yeah, I'm going to fetching that data. And then within a half an hour or quarter to one hour, that you will be see on your screen. Okay. On my channel. Okay. okay awesome. Awesome. Yeah. And yeah, uh, it's a topic. Uh, okay. I mean, it's a recent video. You can see that and you will uh, consider that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. sure. That's the so problem. thanks for That's today, right. but have a great time and greetings to your parents. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.